Oh, hi, Daniel. But hey, our teammate came out in front of him, but we got to get past him, too. Hey gearheads and welcome on back into F122 My Team Career Mode. I'm Alan Bailey. First things first, we have a brand new Bailey Autosport livery. Guess who I got inspiration from? Just take a wild guess, but I love this thing. The red uh, nose and wing are the the red wings are a little much for me, but I mean, look at this side profile, y'all. I mean, that's awesome. I, I love the, the black with those little red, um, you know, design back there. It gave me Mercedes vibes, and um, I just love the silver with that red outline, y'all, on the side of this thing. It's just enough red. Uh, like I said, I wish I could do something more with the wings, but uh, even that's not too bad, you know, uh, with just the red wings uh, on there. So it's a decent balance. I like that it's predominantly black. Like, that's really, really cool for me. Um, I dig it a lot, actually, and uh, second half of this season, hopefully we're going to keep things going in the right direction here, but, I mean, in my head, it's a brand new beginning, so let's put something new on the track, huh? All right, so first time in this ride, man. I It even looks badass in the loading screen, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. So uh, let's go ahead and advance some time here, see if some of the stuff comes in. Ooh, the pistons did I know we were expecting some new developments to come through, but some of them have failed quality control. We'll need to tell a team what to redevelop via the R&D screen. That's good. That's 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 lovely. So at least the side pods came through. That's awesome. Um, you know, we got some big boy meaty upgrades that we're we're working on right here. But I mean, it was the pistons that failed ultimately, and I'm guessing. Oh, we do have a chance. Look at that. We're gonna get it. At least we're gonna get this, and that's going to. Potentially hopscotch over Red Bull if this goes through uh, before the uh, Not this Grand Prix, but the next Grand Prix. So that's gonna be interesting and Then uh, we did have a big boy upgrade come through here as well And I mean it'd be nice to get some of these things, but you know, it's all good. That's um, Helping us a little bit you could see right there on the R&D screen I'm not blocking it too bad that McLaren and Alpha are technically in front of us, but once some of these upgrades come through, we will potentially be be knocking on Red Bull's door as far as car development, which is insane in 2023, but in the beginning of 2022, it was like, okay, uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. So, I mean, we're, we're almost there, man. You know, another couple videos here, and I think it's gonna go good. Morale is high across the board in the art at uh, Bailey Auto Sports and the garage area, so, it's looking good, so let's go ahead and head to the Hungarian Grand Prix weekend. Uh, let's go. It's race day in Budapest as we get ready for another round of Formula One action. We're not expecting too many retirements at this circuit. There are plenty of current and former drivers with flawless finish rates here. In particular, Ralph Schumacher, who made it across the line in all 10 of his Hungarian Grand Prix starts. 14 corners then for our drivers to navigate at the 2.7 mile Hungaro ring today. It's six lefts and eight rights around a lap here with average speeds in the region of 120 miles per hour. So with the race not far away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. A fantastic effort from Charles Leclerc yesterday and it's put him on pole. And the smooth operator Carlos Sainz completes the front row. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Hamilton, Norris, Bailey, and Russell, Ricardo, Perez, Oscar Piastri, and Fernando Alonso, Ocon, Mick Schumacher, Max Verstappen. They'll be starting further back after an earlier grid penalty. And Joe, Bottas, Albon, Pierre Gasly, and Sebastian Vettel, Stroll, Sonoda, Latifi, and Kevin Magnussen fills the last spot on the grid. And with lights out just moments away, it's time to go down to the track. Natalie Pinkham joins me once again in the... After the points finished last race, let's aim to keep that momentum going. 
That's the goal, man. That's the goal. I mean, we qualified sixth and seventh. I have no idea how I out-qualified him. I, I have no idea, but we did. Uh, we were flirting with, like, the front row there for a majority of the lap, and then, um, you know, by sector three, I, I just made a couple mistakes, and it was like, okay, okay, yeah, it's fine. I mean, I could have rewound it, but I chose not to. So we're fifth, which is where I think um, where we're going to actually end up here. But, I mean, first off, let's take out some of that extra fuel. Give us just a, a little bit more, just in case, because we do have some clouds coming in here. So, I mean, soft to uh, soft to medium, and I practice on the medium, and I am not that great on the medium, but the softies, I mean, we're sporty. So, I mean, I just got to figure out how to just race in softies the entire time, and I'll be fine. That's all it takes. That's all it takes. Cool. But let's go ahead and see what we got out here. Uh, race number 13, I want to say. Let's go. Starting fifth and sixth. Let's go. Are we up to third? How did we do that? How did we do that? Okay. I'm not complaining. Our lack of cars is starting to show up a little. But, I mean, we're still third, man. I don't know. Maybe we can hold on to uh, top five here, maybe. I don't know. Charles is fast. Who knew? We're still third, man. I mean, DRS we purple. Enabled this lap. We can use DRS when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. I don't know. I don't think. The car behind uh, is dropping back by about three tenths a lap. Well done. Huh? Tires are starting to go. I'm starting to lose focus. I'm getting back in it. Check in in a bit. Okay, focus. We need to stay on form. Trying to. Hey, when I got a target in front of me, I drive better, so... Wow, Norris. All right. All right, Lando. Game on. I'm within DRS, dude. That's awesome, but I'm I'm focused on Lando at the moment. Yeah, that's what I thought, Lando. Team no lift. Let's go. No, thank you. And you can see Russell coming, man. He's sixth. He's right behind Lando, so get up here, bud. In this lap, in this lap. Uh, we're Push pitting now. this time anyway, so here he comes. That's good. We held him up. We held him up, I should say, long enough for our teammate to catch up. Heat stop. Made it. So, I mean, fourth on entry, man, and they're pitting too, so this could get interesting. Uh, I forgot what button it is. I'm just going to push them all. I don't know what button it was, but I pushed them all, and it worked. Cool. That was a fantastic why, stop. Faster why did we expected. let him go? Why did we let him go? Pit strategy complete. See these tires through to the end now. Uh-huh. Come on, Heat. Come on, Heat. Come on, Heat. Get in these tires. I need them to get grippy. Come 
More beat stops coming at you. Oh, hi, Daniel. But hey, our teammate came out in front of him, but we got to get past him too. Stay back there, boys. So Russell and Norris have gotten around us. Russell is our teammate. Good for the teammate, man. Go get those points, bud. We're seventh right now. I question if everybody stopped. I don't know if they did. Maybe they did. But I mean... Ooh, we got a pit stop. I'll take it, man. Gasly coming in. You can see we're catching Lando ever so slightly, but we are. Dive bomb, baby. We were just close enough. Now we got to hold them off. White flag next time by, but he's getting closer. So far, so good. So far. Charles Leclerc wins. Lando is all over us. Russell comes home fourth, we come home fifth, a couple of top fives, another double points day. Let's go. All right, race over. Take care of the car on the way in. I'm blown away. I am blown away. I Good for Verstappen, but holy shnikes, y'all. Here come our winners now, a thrilling race and a tremendous effort by Ferrari. Their history is well known, so it's no surprise to fans the world over to see them come out on top once again. Hey man, we were right there. We were fourth and fifth. I'm just saying, we're not too far off and we're about to get even better. Enjoy it boys. We're coming for you. Next race, I got a feeling. Here we come, here comes Bailey Autosport. I mean, I'm, I, I, I literally could not have asked for a better result. Yeah, getting a podium, uh, two podiums would have been amazing, but we're not there yet, man. I mean, you can see it, 19 seconds and uh, 25 off. I mean, we got work to do, especially me as a driver. I got to get used to driving a Formula One car again. I hadn't driven it in seven, eight months, however long it's been since we recorded last. So I'm pretty, pretty stoked, man, that we're here and... I'm loving the fact that we're coming alive just as we bring this new, uh, you know, the career mode back. You know, I'm amazed that it came back. I didn't think we were going to get this in before 23 came out. So um, hopefully it, it fires up for us next time. Honestly, this could be the last one for a while. Uh, I don't know. But bash that subscribe button so that you do not miss a video. I'm curious to see what happens. Um you know, we the fact that we beat both McLarens and both Red Bulls, man, that means we're legitimately contending, contending to race for the number two spot on the grid. And I think a lot of that has to do with Oscar Piatri kind of weighing down Mercedes right now. But I mean, we stole George Russell away from Mercedes and gave him Oscar. And I mean, because of that, we're legitimately contending with them now, like seriously. So I know Lewis was our rival um, you know, early on in the series, but I mean, now it's not such, it's not, it's not so crazy, man. I mean, I, I still think that, uh, Lando and Daniel are both are my rivals at the moment because of the McLaren, how close they are with McLaren, but honestly, not too bad. Like I'm, I'm fairly impressed with how we're running. Let's check the uh, point standings actually. I want to thank you so much for watching. If you haven't mashed that subscribe button, come on back for the next one. And, uh, I'm excited, man.
we're going to keep on rolling. We should have some massive upgrades coming out in the next video. Hopefully, major, major upgrades that are hopefully going to make us uh, a little bit sportier through these corners. Uh, make us even better uh, so that we can legitimately contend for that second position on the grid. Because we're definitely, we're definitely knocking on Mercedes' door, man. We're definitely right there. So, thank you so much for watching. For F122 My Team Career Mode, I'm Alan Bailey. We'll see you at the track. Bye, Gearheads.